A big push to erase student loan debt, Democratic presidential candidate Bernie Sanders proposed a new plan to wipe out student loan debt within six months for the 45 million Americans who have it. Here's a look at how he plans to do it. We should not be punishing people for getting a higher education. It is time to hit the reset button. Bernie Sanders came out swinging in defense of college students and graduates with student loan debt. A newly proposed bill, the College for All Act, which he co-sponsored, aims to eliminate debt by asking Wall Street to pay up. The American people bailed out Wall Street. Now it is time for Wall Street to come to the aid of the middle class of this country. With Sanders' plan, taxes would be imposed on the trade of stocks, bonds, and derivatives, a half percent tax on stock transactions, and a tenth percent tax on bonds. My family is making a grant to eliminate their student loans. Last month, elation filled Morehouse College's commencement ceremony when billionaire Robert Smith vowed to pay off all their student loan debt, an estimated $40 million. Sanders' plan would erase $1.6 trillion in debt. Tuition would also be free for public universities like UGA, community colleges, and trade schools. Support for Sanders' plan was mixed on our 11 Alive Facebook page. Michelle saying, my kids have thousands in student loan debt, but that is their responsibility. But Marcy said the loan forgiveness would help get young grads off to a great start. The average college student in the U.S. graduates with nearly $30,000 of debt. Sanders is not the first to recognize how student loan debt can impact college graduates. In April, another 2020 Democratic presidential candidate, Elizabeth Warren, pitched a similar plan. It would tax two cents on every dollar on fortunes greater than $50 million. And we asked you if you would support this plan. You can see the results right there on the bottom of your screen. Now, remember, this is just a proposed plan. So if you have student loan debt, do not stop paying it. And we have some ways to help tackle that student loan debt. You can just go to 11alive.com to see the list. And you can also tell us if you like the idea. Just click in the 11 Live app to vote in our poll. And we are less than two days away from the first Democratic presidential debate. 20 candidates will face off in a two-night event right here on 11 Alive. You don't want to miss it. It's this Wednesday and Thursday starting at 9 p.m. Then make sure to stay tuned for Up Late at 11 for all of the reaction.